honestly, it just brings back great memories of me doing ballet. Oh, I'm for it. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here, my name is Nengi and I shoot fashion, lifestyle and travel style videos. And today's video is going to be on like simple outfits for people who don't love a lot of color. And you know, summer is that time to be bright and bold, but there are people out there who love the season, but don't necessarily like just being the loudest in the room with regards to their clothes. So I just thought I'd put a video together for those people who love a bit of monochrome in summer, a bit of nudes, chocolate browns, dusty pinks and things like that. So very muted tones. So, you know, I think it'll be cool to just see how you can style these colors in this weather. And if you're new here and if you know, you're an old subscriber, then thank you so much for watching and thank you for supporting me. Um, yeah, so if you're still interested in watching, then let's get into this video. So this dress is just one of those simple numbers. It has puffy sleeves and it's just really cute. It gives me Little House on the Prairie, if anyone's seen that. And I just love the way it fits, I like the cut, and yeah, I think it's just very nice. And you can literally just pair it with like some cute pumps. And yeah, this is how it looks. I paired it with this bag I got from ASOS. This is cool as well for people who are not into super bright colors. Yeah, I think it's really nice. Like you can wear it to like drinks, you can wear it to the park even, but you probably want to swap the shoes if you're going to the park. But yeah, I think it's perfect. So at first when I got this waistcoat, I was like, girl, be a waitress. Will this even be cool? But then I was like, I think it's cool. And I got it, and I wasn't wrong. So I feel like this is one of those outfits that could be worn to like a semi-formal event so you know those work but not work type functions where you want to look cool but you still want to look smart so smart casual why does that take me so long to say i digress so yeah this could be worn to one of those cute work drinks and i just really like it i think everyone should have a slip skirt in their wardrobe regardless of color regardless of like length i think the midi ones work really well and it's perfect for different outfits. So I'll come a little bit closer. You can see the waistcoat. It's really nice. I paired it with this um, wallet on chain that I got from Zara. It's really cool. It has a super long chain. So you can wear it cross body as well. But I tend to like tuck it in and I use the like hoop as a bangle and I hold it there. So yeah, I think it's perfect. Perfect for the occasion. It can be worn with different slip skirts. So. because not only is it black but it has like cool patterns on it so it's not just super plain I like the way it fits flows and yeah so it's not just boring it's quite nice although like a satin black skirt wouldn't just be boring but this one has a little bit of drama to it so I quite like it so if you've been watching my videos you know you've seen this dress before I got it from ASOS and I just love it because it is literally just that simple it's a simple slip satin dress and it's very nice. It's not too figure hugging, but it does give you a nice silhouette. And I decided to pair it with this bag that I got from H&M when I thought I was still going to be traveling in 2020, but clearly it's not happening. And I like it because it's made of raffia and it's just really cool. And obviously I'll link it below if it's still in stock, but I thought that it'd be cool to just see how it goes because this would remind you of going for dinner. But I think that it can work well with a bag like this because this is super summery, made of raffia, and this could be one of those I'm going for like a light salad and drink. But I'll come a little bit closer so you can see the dress, so you can see the bag. The bag also comes with a strap, but I haven't unraveled it yet. And yeah, it's super nice. Haven't used it yet, but can't wait to take it out on the town. So guys, this is another outfit and I love it so much. Immediately I saw this skirt on ASOS, I knew I had to have it and it was out of stock for ages so I like did the whole reminder thing and it reminded me and I got it in like a UK 8. Why I love this skirt so much is because it just takes me back to my days of being a prima ballerina. So I used to do ballet when I was younger and this is the skirt that we would wear under our leotard, on top of our leotards to 
dance ballet. I'll see if I find a picture and I'll pop up my old little ballerina pictures. I have a video as well because I did a ballet recital and yeah, nearly I swear I was like, this is just too cute. So this is the skirt. It wraps like twice around and obviously you can see the string. So yeah, it's so cute. I actually didn't want to pair it with this top. I wanted to pair it with an actual leotard that is the same color, but that didn't arrive on time. I've been looking for that leotard for ages and then I finally found this same chocolate color um, in leotard. This is just a top that's tucked in. So yeah. Why I prefer that with this guy is because it covers me all the way to like my neck, my like actual collarbone, and I like that with this skirt, but this still works. And I just paired it with this little bag that I got from Zara ages ago. And it is cute. Honestly, it just brings back great memories of me doing ballet. Oh, I'm point. Summer, but I'm here to prove you wrong. See, long sleeves only work when the fabric is quite light, so it's actually not as hot as you think it is. And I really love this dress, I think it is so sexy. There's something about dresses that are just, I guess, shape because they don't hold you in any shape, so they suit different body types because you can let the dress speak for itself, not necessarily trying to show your figure. I think it's really nice. I think it's super summery and I decided to pair it with this pearl bag. And yeah, so this is the dress. And you know, you can literally choose where you want to wear it to. It comes with like a slip underneath and it's from ASOS. I will link it below because I think it's still available. I don't even think it was in the sale. I think it's quite current, but I love it so much. And I see, I feel so grown when I'm wearing it. I haven't worn it out yet, but I intend to. Yeah, let me know what you think if you can wear this out um, yeah, it's perfect and i'm sure as you've noticed i love satin and silk dresses and the fabric literally i've always said if i was in fabric i'd probably be silk it is my personality it's just my taste and i just love it so this is another cute number and i got this from nasty gal i think it's really nicely summery especially if you want that all white look so it's super clean It's just really chic but one thing i'll say about these slip dresses you have to you've got to pay good money to get the ones that are really good quality because as you can see i don't like how the line that is supposed to cover your bust is showing through so you can tell it's thin so it's not my favorite i really do like quality stuff but i mean just for affordability i think it's good for that and yeah it could be worn to varying occasions i think it'd be cute and pair it with some flat sandals and you're good to go to the park, pair it with some tiny heels like this and you're ready for drinks. So yeah. So guys, this is the last outfit and this is another Little House on the Prairie vibe because obviously cute little milkmaid top. I love a good milkmaid top. I love them to bits. They're super cute and they can actually be quite sexy as well. I feel like when you can get the balance of cute and sexy, you're winning. But anyway, it's really nice. I paired it with this um, ballerina style skirt again, wrap skirt, and uh, with this little bag. This bag I got from Depop, and it's literally so tiny. It fits, I don't know, lipstick, ID, all the essentials, but it's super tiny. It does go over your shoulder though, but I don't know. Oh. Yeah. But I think this outfit is super cute. I think it works really well. I'm a fan of looking sharp, regardless of the occasion. So guys, that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you saw pieces that you loved and things that you're going to put together for yourself. And please, please, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hit the bell so you can be notified when I post new videos and all that good stuff. I'll put my Instagram um, handle um, in the description as well as on the screen so you can follow me on Instagram as well because I style a lot of these pieces that I've just shown you on my Instagram and yeah if you can check out my other videos that'll be great as well I'll leave them on the screen but thank you thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye